Okay, in this question, uh, we're asked to find the area enclosed by the curves y equals x squared and y equals negative x squared plus 4. So, to get a sense of what's being asked here, we first of all draw a picture of what these look like. We know that our function y equals x squared looks like this. Now if we look at this function, negative x squared plus 4, clearly when x is 0, uh, y is 0, so that also goes through the origin. Also we see fairly clearly that if uh, x is 4, then I have uh, negative 16 plus 16 is 0, so it comes back here at 4. So it evidently does something like this. Now, of course, what we'd like to know is what this point here is, because this is the area we need to find, the area between these two uh, curves. Right, to find the uh, point of intersection, of course, what we're going to have to do is uh, make these two equal to each other, like so. And when we solve this, we're going to get 2x squared minus 4x equals 0. Uh, divide through by 2 gives me x squared minus 2x equals 0. And of course that means that I have x by x minus 2 equals 0. So x is equal to 0 and 2. So clearly this point up here is 2, 4. Okay. Alright, now <coughs> we now want to look at what the area is going to be. Uh, if you look at this, if I look at the area underneath this curve here, which is the y equals negative x squared plus 4x, and if I do it between, so this point is 2, okay, then uh, if I find the area underneath this upper curve, which is the negative x squared plus 4x, and I subtract the area underneath the lower curve, which is x squared, and I subtract those two, then I should get the required area. So consequently, our area is going to be equal to the integral from 0 to 2 of the upper curve with respect to dx minus the integral from 0 to 2 of the lower curve with respect to dx. So we're going to subtract these two. Now of course because the uh, limits of integration are the same this is really just simply the integral from 0 to 2 of negative x squared plus 4x minus x squared with respect to dx. Okay, <coughs> now we simplify this as the integral from 0 to 2 of negative 2x squared plus 4x with respect to dx. Now since this is a polynomial function it's very easy to uh, integrate. We just do the reverse uh, power rule or the power rule for integration and this will become negative 2 remains the same x cubed on 3 plus 4 x squared on 2 and we have to evaluate that between 0 and 2. If I simplify this, this of course is from a negative 2 thirds x cubed plus 2x squared between 0 and 2. Now, we're applying the fundamental theorem of calculus now. This means that I'm going to have 2 thirds by 2 cubed uh, plus 2 by 2 squared. And of course, when I put 0 in here for x, I get 0 and uh, 0 for x here, I get 0, so just subtracting 0. And so consequently I end up with 2 cubed is 8, 2 is a 16, negative 16 on 3, plus 2 squared is 4, 4 2s are 8. So I end up with negative 16 on 3 plus 24 on 3, which of course is 8 on 3 uh, units squared will be the area between these two curves.